situations where failure is an option. So my plane is definitely on its last legs. It's got a massive crack on the wing here. It's pretty much broken off. The only thing that's holding it is this uh, duct tape. I haven't been filming my flights very much lately. I've just been coming out here and uh, flying for fun. I did something the other day which was a lot of fun. On a, on a day like today where there's not much wind, I got the plane uh, circling like on autopilot. I just put the remote down and just watched it circle for like two minutes. And uh, eventually I had to, to pick up the remote. And uh, so I got the idea, uh, let's, let's time and see how long I get the plane to fly on autopilot. Now, I don't know if I could do it today. It's, there's a slight breeze today. The other day it was um, like absolutely no wind. But my challenge to you is after I'm done, uh, I'll tell you my time, my best time. See if you can beat me. Post it as a video reply. Now, there's a lot of people here playing tennis, so I've got to be careful. Try not to fly over their heads. Keep it, uh, keep it out there where there's nobody. Here we go. Always nervous throwing for the first time. Never know what disaster can happen. I've had a lot of disasters. I don't know what the wind conditions are up there. Probably uh, different from down here. Clear the timer. And go. I don't want to fly into the sun because it's silhouettes and then I uh, have trouble figuring out what it's doing. Seems to be turning uh, to the left more and more and more here. Got my finger ready on the uh, close close to the um, ailerons here in case I need it. Seems to be uh, losing altitude too. But uh, we're up to 40 seconds here, so I already broke my previous record. Low here, get a little low. I don't want to crash it, so I'm uh, straightening out, and that was one minute. I'm going to give it a little more throttle. Clear the timer. Okay, hitting the timer. We are no hands. That is high. Look how high that is. Now it is it is making constant left turns, but my fear is that it uh, the wind might take it away. It might decide to uh, turn to the right or something. I, I think with the throttle I gave it, it's climbing. I think I gave it too much throttle. It's getting higher and higher. Getting a little uncomfortable with its height, so um we're at 40 seconds here. Let me see if I can break the one minute mark. I can cut back on the throttle and then I'll have uh, some altitude to uh, bring it back down. All right, one minute. Go for one minute ten. Okay. Now I'm, I'm cutting back on the throttle now. And uh, starting the timer. Hopefully I cut back enough so it'll start coming down. Now it seems to be getting further away. I'm 
to stop the timer and um, see if I can't get it closer. It's getting a little too far. Okay, starting the timer. It's a little lower, a little closer now. Still kind of uncomfortable with its distance and height. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it closer. I have a feeling the wind is kind of taking it away, so I don't want it to get to the point where I've lost control. Back over here. All right, now let's start start our turn. Just hitting the timer. Now we're at a comfortable height. It's flying almost directly over me. Getting into the sun there. Man, those clouds. I can't wait till I get my. Uh, uh, FPV, first person um, view system. Oh, it, it's getting lower. We're at 30 seconds here. Getting a little too low for comfort there. All right, taking over. <laughs> kind of heading toward that tree and stuff. All right, hit the timer. Fifteen seconds. Oh, it seems to be climbing. That is that is definitely higher than it was when it last came around. Just past 30 seconds. Man, I wish I could find a throttle where it just was uh, staying at the right altitude. Because that is just going way high. 52 seconds. I need binoculars soon. Let's, well, uh, okay. We've got a minute, 15 seconds. And it, it's definitely getting further away. So the, the wind is taking it uh, further and further away. So at this point, I'm gonna cut it at uh, one more time around. And then we'll bring it back. Okay, a minute 45. Okay, gonna bring it in for a landing and uh, take a rest. That's about as good of a landing as you could expect on grass. Actually, I was wrong. They're actually playing cricket over there. That's cool. Tennis court has become a cricket court. My goal is to beat two minutes or stop at two minutes. It seems like a nice round number to go for. So we got a minute 45 seconds so far. Here we go.
Okay, starting timer. That's the nice thing about a day with no wind is that uh, it won't blow your plane away. It'll, it'll actually circle in place. So I'm at a disadvantage today because the, the breeze is taking it further and further away on every pass. It just gets further away. So success really depends on um, how still your air is. I seem to be losing altitude here. And I'm barely at a minute. I don't think it's going to make it here. I gotta, gotta compensate. Give it a touch more throttle. Let's bring it back. Again, I don't want to fly over the people, so. If I can trim it a little so it doesn't turn so sharply. This is hard, so this is my challenge to you. See how long you can you can fly without uh, without user control. In the timer. Now that buzzing you hear is not actually the engine; it's the tape on the bottom flapping in the wind. Fifteen seconds. Seems to be staying at a fairly consistent altitude. But it is getting further away, which I don't like. It's, it's actually too, too far already. <sighs> oh, something is wrong. Something is wrong. Trying to bring it in for a landing. I don't know what's wrong. But you saw how it suddenly turned uh, one direction. I have no idea. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get you in the high grass. Safe thing to do. <laughs> that high grass has saved my plane so many times. I've crashed in the high grass and I've not gotten any damage. So. Let's go check it out. So yeah, it's completely unharmed. The grass is like this high, so... I have no idea why it was going out of control. It's probably not smart to uh, keep flying, but uh, I think I will. I think I'm just gonna fly around for fun. And um, hopefully whatever the problem is won't, uh, won't resurface or um, cause it to crash. Now, I mean, one theory is uh, there's other radio signals affecting it. It's a possibility. Oh, the batteries are, are gone. Ooh. Not too bad. So, yeah, when the batteries go, sometimes uh, it's without warning, and you're, and you're trying to do something and you've got no power. So, but uh, I don't think I got any damage. Let's go check it out. All right, no damage. The time to beat is a minute 45 seconds. Post your video reply if, if you beat it.